Hello everyone, I'm Gwendolyn. Today I want to introduce this machine QD01A. This machine is specially designed for out diameter of small size workpiece. It can hand grinding tasks such as workpiece step, tapers, and angles. Suitable for workpiece like punchers, pins, and the bar chopper. The machine's oversize is 100 cm long, 15 cm wide, and 115 cm tall. The work table stock front to back is 14 mm and the left to right is 17 mm. The machine is made up of two parts, the grinding head part and the workpiece head part. Now let's have a look at the grinding head part first. It adopts a mechanical spender driven by a 715 watt motor wheel balance transmission. The spender speed can up to 6500 rpm. It's equipped with a grinding wheel with a 25.4 mm inner hole. Each grid of the front and the rear hand wheel is 0.005 mm, which can actually counter the speed of the grinding wheel. Now, let's take a look at the workpiece head part. It uses the roller and the pressure wheel for position. The roller is driven by a motor with a speed of up to 115 rpm. The entire workpiece head is mounted on an angle blade, which can be adjusted according to the grinding wheels to charge the angles of the workpiece head. The rollers can clamp workpiece with a diameter of 1 to 25 mm. For size beyond this range, a customer's special mood is a requirement. Now, we will demonstrate the workpiece Dell indicator measurements. First, we clean the roller to ensure there are no particles, which could affect the Dell indicator actually. Next, we clamp a stand around the bar. Then, we secure the Dell indicator. Now, let's start the Dell indicator tracking. You can see that the Dell indicator run out is maintained at around 0.002 mm. Now let's try grinding a workpiece. First, secure the workpiece with the pressure wheel. Adjust the fixed road and the expanding length of the workpiece. After confirming everything is in proper order, we power on the machine start the motor and the road motor. Position the grinding wheel accurately. Determine the required grinding allowance. And set the value on the inner scale. Now, we can start grinding. All right, the workpiece grinding is completed. As you can see, the operation is very simple. If there are too much dust during grinding, you can equip a vacuum cleaner. If the workpiece temperature gets too high, you can turn on the cooling system. We provide a cooling device as standard. When the grinding wheel is used for a while, we need to dress the grinding wheel. Install the accessory in the fixed position. Adjust the angles and the length of the diamond pan and set the distance between the grinding wheel and the, the diamond pan's connector surface. After starting the power, move left and right and we can quickly make the outer surface of the grinding wheel smooth. For dressing the side, before this method, just change the movement direction to back and forth. When we need to grind different workpiece, we need to replace grinding wheel with one that 
which is the tool materials and the grinding requirements. First, use one wrench to hold the spell properly in place. And on the other side, use another wrench to engulf with these two holes. Turn the two wrenches in opposite directions, and the grinding wheel flange can be easily removed. Then take off the grinding wheel and replace it with the required one. If you want to know more about this machine, please contact us now.